Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. For those who are new, my name is Denise, and this is where I found. Hi Lucy. Up. Good girl. And this is Lucy. She's in every single one of my videos for some reason. She knows that I am filming and she comes to say hello in the beginning. Hi baby girl. I do want to apologize for any noise you hear in the background. Junior is in the room, in his room, playing Fortnite, and he gets really loud when he has his headphones set on. He can't seem to keep his, his voice down. I also do have my sliding door open, so I apologize for any noise that comes from the outside and whatever noise Lucy makes. And possibly you'll hear the kids screaming because they're fighting over something stupid. Which all kids apparently do. So anyways, um, I am going to, well, anyways, if you follow me on any of my social medias, Last night, I posted a picture, which I'll insert somewhere in here for you guys can see. I was playing around. I was pretty bored of just laying down on my couch with my heat pad on, which I have no idea where I left it, and I pretty much need it. But anyways, um, I got bored, pretty much, and I decided to play around with the makeup, and... I actually did a look just using Gerard Cosmetics, obviously, but there was no like makeup on my face or even powder on my face. You know, it was just my bare skin. All I used for a base was this guy. I use pretty much these two little palettes here, which is one is a contour and blush and the other one's a highlight highlighter palette i just use these two products for my eyes and the contouring and the blush and the highlighting in general um and i used a lip product that i love very much actually which is night shift in the drawer cosmetics pencil and a man eater and it came out really, really nice, actually, believe it or not. And I was so impressed in how it came out that I just had to post it. And a cousin of mine and my sister from another mister and mother, because she's not really my sister, but we see each other as family. She's my sister to me. Like the look a lot too. Even Jen looked, loved the look that I thought that I recreated and actually show you guys what I did. Even though it was a very simple look that took me maybe 10 minutes to do. Um, and I should have been drinking Coke. But I can't stop drinking my Coke. I love Coke way too much. And I make Coca-Cola, not the other thing. I don't touch that shit. So yeah, I pretty much used Dura Cosmetics for this look. So first I'm going to prime my face. I already have lashes on, so I won't be using any mascara. But I should curl them so I'll be right back because I have to go grab my eyelash curler and my chapstick. So be right back. All right so I am back. I, am, I actually had to grab my other highlighter. This one is in Bridget. I'm gonna try using this guy right here too which is a really pretty golden ish like rose gold kind of of a highlighter so I'm gonna use that I am going to 
I'm going to prime my lips with this amazing chapstick that my husband actually bought. He bought all three that he saw from this company. It says Lip Freak. Freak your lips out. Just this right here. And we can see that it's cinnamon. It's cinnamon and mint, and this has the strongest buzzing lip balm in the whole world. Let me tell you, it burns, it tingles, it numbs your lips. If you lick your lips, it numbs your mouth. But I love it. And on top of that, believe it or not, I am going to put my Kissed Assist from Gerard Cosmetics because I love this stuff a lot. It just adds to the tingling sensation. And this is actually a lip plumper, but that's not the reason why I use it. I just like the way it makes my lips feel. All right, so I am going to prep my skin. I'm gonna shake this first. It's a Gerard Cosmetics Mystified Hydrating Facial Mist. I love this stuff, like, love it. It's like my holy grail. I put it all over my face and I even put it on my chest, believe it or not, because it makes everything so hydrating and I just love it in general. So I'm going to do my brows and I'm using the brow bar to go and mine is in the eb medium to ebony and this is what it looks like. This is the wax. Um, I'm guessing... This will be ebony and this might be medium. I'm not sure. But anyways, I have brunette hair, as you know. So I have to use a brunette powder. And I can't find my usual brow. My usual brow um brush so i am going to use this lab two stroke of genius brow and eyeliner brush this is what it looks like see so lab two or lab square whatever you want to call it do you see what are you doing She's humping her bed while stepping on her toy on one of the many lammies that she has. So I have a mirror right in front of me. And I'm going to use this for, ow, for my brows. First, I am going to just grab the wax. Just to set them a little bit. Excuse me. Before I put some color. And I'm going to grab a Fully. Just brush them a bit. Just where I can shape them how I want. Now I'm going to grab the color in the middle with a little bit of wax, even though I just added that to my brows themselves. But I still use, use it for the actual color. Again, I start with my tail all the time. And then I just feel them after that. I won't growl, grab, growl, grab any more wax, just the powder. I also want to thank you guys for the positive feedback on my last video that just went up yesterday. I apologize for the lighting. It's already dark outside, believe it or not. In fact, it's been cloudy all day. We have some rain coming soon, I hope. We need rain. We really do. Um, so I'm still trying to figure out the whole lighting situation with this little ring light that's for my phone that I attached to this camera. So I hope, well, I'm still trying to figure out what actually works. I was going to film earlier today, but... Well, I just didn't feel like filming earlier today, believe it or not. So, tail. 
whatever's left. Um, on the brow. Like I was really, really bored and I just, you know, put on music on my phone and I just went into town and just created this look and I fell in love with it. So I had to share it and a lot of you liked it. All right. Now to clean out my brows. And yes, I will clean out my brows, even though I said I want to only draw cosmetics. But to clean my brows, I do have to use my next Above and Beyond Full Coverage Concealer. And it's in the color Porcelain. I actually love this stuff. I even use it as a base, but I won't be using it as a base today. The only base I'll be using on my eyes will be the Illuminizing BB Cream from Jar Cosmetics. Now where is my blending brush? Keep losing that thing. Like seriously, losing the damn thing is so small that it hides just about anywhere. And I can't find it until I don't need it again. Nope. Not there. I'll just use this teeny tiny brush. This was actually from Mark from Avon. I've had this for so long. I don't even know if Avon still has the brand Mark. When it first came out, I was just like, just makeup products and brushes and perfumes and stuff like that. It was pretty pricey, but I did get a nice set of brushes a long time ago. This is actually the only brush I have left from that particular set of brushes. I have no idea what happened to the rest. All right, so I'm working on the eyes now, and there goes my <sighs> lipstick. So we're going to work on the eyes now. And like I said, I'll be using the BB Illuminating Plus um, BB Cream from Gerard. And mine is in the color Sophia, as you can see there, right here. Can you see that? No. There we go. So I'm going to zoom you guys in a little bit. You guys can see what I'll be doing. And where is the brush I use? And I'm going to use this brush right here, which is the e.l.f. eyeshadow stipple brush. It's a dual fiber one. And I actually will be adding the entire, just one pump on the back of my hand. And I'll be adding this all over my eyelid. You can hear either Kalem's phone, she's playing music, or it's Junior. One of those two. It's okay if it's messy. I'm going to be putting product over that. So it's okay. Actually, it's not even a phone, it's an iPod. I'm not ready for a phone. Nope. Not yet. But they call it a phone. I'm going to put it all the way to my brow bone as well. 
I guess I'll be putting product over this. This will just be my base. And you'll see the magic that I created last night. Take that off with the paper towel that I have here. My lips are really tingly. So I'm actually going to start, I, yesterday I started with this, which with, with Lucy. I put that all over and more on the crease side, but I think I'm going to have to bridge it instead of, instead of Lucy. Actually, no, I'm going to go with Lucy. I like the color anyway. And I'm going to use a Profusion um, contouring brush. That's what they call it. But, you know, I don't follow the rules when it comes to brushes. So I'm just going to use my hand. Yeah. And, of course, it's Dry Cosmetics. You can get yourself one on their website too, on DryCosmetics.com. And for all these products, you can get them yourself. And you use my code, Denise, G84, D-E-N-I-C-E-84, for 30% off. But starting tomorrow, you won't be able to use it. Because tomorrow will start, it'll begin of Black Friday or the holiday um, sales. But there is a link that you can use that will still, you know, give you the magic percent not the magic percentage but I uh, if you use my link I can still get a commission using that and the entire site will be on sale starting tomorrow from tomorrow to the 27th um so what time hello hi so starting tomorrow at 10 a.m. all the way till Tuesday, November 27th, midnight, the entire site will be 51% off. You heard me correct. And it's free shipping for all orders um, over $35, and that's internationally as well. How the heck did you get it on the TV? I have it plugged in with my HDMI thing. Oh. Yeah. Why do you have it like that? Huh? Why do you have it like that? Well, because my camera doesn't have a screen that I can flip, so I use a TV. Oh. I know. That's weird. Crazy, huh? Mm-hmm. So I'm using Lucy on my crease. I'm surprised Lucy doesn't come over here when I say Lucy, but she's eating. Yeah. <laughs> did you just <laughs> how did you just fall I don't know oh my god we've all been so clumsy today we all been tripping and falling and slipping oh well, my brother pushed me all over the place today we went to Vaughn's and I was getting out of my car I tripped my foot got stuck to the bottom part of my seat, and I just tripped. That's weird. I know, right? Everything is weird. It's been a weird day. Yeah. It's like there's something going on with the planets. It's just making everything go bonkers. Pet, pet. <laughs> Are you okay, Kaylin? I just wanted to pet. Why? Because I want to do. You're bored, aren't you? Eh, I'm going to go back to my game. Okay. So that's on my crease. And then I am going to grab the lightest color on here, which is Grace, which is this one right here. Look how sparkly it is. And I'm going to grab just a regular one. Well, not a regular. Well, yeah. <sighs> a lot of breath. That just means my asthma is acting up. I don't even know where my inhaler is. 
So I'm just going to grab a flat brush, a flat packing brush. Um, and I'll be putting setting spray on it. I'll just use this flat one. Quite literally, this is a generic flat liner brush. I'm going to spray slay all day on both sides. And I am going to grab, excuse me, Grace. And I am putting that, just grabbing the product on both sides of the brush. And I'm just going to do my lid. I'm just packing the color all over while spreading it all over. And it goes a lash. You're going to fall just fall. Gosh darn it. Just a lash. I didn't want to stick on today. Can you guys see that? And as usual, Sean texted me in the middle of, oh, he's a football game? I didn't even know he liked football. I didn't even know you liked sports, Sean. We've been friends since the ninth grade and I didn't even know that. Well, have fun at the game, Sean. Have yeah, fun. All right, so I'm green. I grabbed more product and I put more setting spray on the brush and I grabbed the product with both sides of the brush, just like I did with the other eye. I'm just putting it all over my lid. Just all over the lid. And I'm gonna grab a dry brush. I'll just grab this. Urban Decay one. And I am going to grab Marilyn. Just to dry the way it is. Just put it on my brush. And I'm going to go over that and just pack it. On the lid. That's all I did. On both sides. And that are and that's what I do to the eyes. And like I said, I didn't put any foundation on or any powder compact um, powder foundation on my face whatsoever. I just went straight to the Starlet palette or honeymoon palette, whichever you want to call it, and I ended up putting um, wifed up which is this one right here as a contour and I grabbed this amazing airbrushed brush from e.l.f. This is the 105 brush which is pretty awesome if you ask me. Actually it wasn't. It was actually forever bronzer. It's what I use. Grab a little bit and just Contour a little bit. Can you guys even see that? Let's see if I can change the light a little bit. Maybe that would help. Can you guys see that? Because I really can't. <laughs> I really can't. And I just Rub it really, really lightly on my cheeks, just very lightly. And then I put some on my forehead and temples, just a little bit, just a little bit. And then with the same brush, I grab the, um, actually, no, before I do that, I grab, actually, I'm going to do it with the stippling brush. Just gonna grab a regular elf stippling brush 
We'll put a little bit of the, the Illuminating BB Cream. And I am going to highlight. Just going to stipple that on. And then I am going to grab my Real Techniques Beauty Sponge and just blend that in. My Beauty Sponge is damped. I'm going to put a little bit of the mist, just if I want. I'm just going to grab some. Put some on my palm, on the back of my hand, and grab a little bit of that again. And just a little bit. Believe it or not, a little bit goes a long way. This is how pigmented all of the products are. But really, all you need is a little bit. That's why I love this stuff a lot. I really do. It's not, and I'm not getting paid to say amazing stuff about the products. I just genuinely love, love, I mean, love the products. I really do. And like I said, I am not getting paid to say positive things about the products. I just genuinely love it. Now I'm going to put some blush. It. Using the same brush, I'm going to grab um, first class blush and just on the apples of my cheeks. And this is also very pigmented, so you have to be very, very light with the product. And it's okay if I put it over the, um, the baby cream. It just grabs on better. And that's pretty much all I do. And now I go back to the highlighting palette. And I grab Grace once again. And I'm gonna use this brush from Wet n Wild, which is a large, puffy, brush, grab some of that product, and go over the area where I put the illuminating BB cream at. And it just grabs on to the highlighter even more because it's, you know, a base. And I like to go all the way to the top of where my eyebrow, like the mid part of my eyebrow, and just do like a moon type thing. That's what I like to do. I just like highlight in general. Go on the tip of my nose. Cubit's bow. And then I just grab a regular fluffy brush. So I'm gonna grab the one from Wet n Wild. Just blend that a little bit. Especially the nose, I think I put too much on my nose. And there goes the brush. Put that back in my drawer thing. And then I grab Night Shift. And it's a very plummy color if you get what I mean I do overline my lips a little bit don't get me wrong I do because I'm so used to having plump lips naturally but as I've gotten older my lips have shrunk if that makes sense and I don't know if that's too impossible but that's what's been going on with my lips so I do overline them a little bit
And then I grabbed Man Eater, which is a supreme cream from Dry Cosmetics again. And that's pretty much the whole look. And that is the whole look. I'm just gonna curl my lashes a little bit. Just a little. Oops. And that's the whole look. Take off my headband. And that is the whole look. It's easy, it's fast, obviously explaining it step by step, it doesn't, you know, it takes a little longer, it's not quick. But this is a whole look, just using a few products without any foundation of any kind. <sighs> I'm so out of breath, I gotta find my inhaler. Just a few products, like I said, just pretty much highlighters and blush and a very light bronzer that's about it. it is a whole look that I did last night that I'm doing for you guys now well that I did for you guys now so I hope you guys enjoy and if you do give it a thumbs up if you like me and my channel go ahead and subscribe if you haven't already click on the little bell assuming the little bell works because I know it doesn't work for everyone I know I don't get notifications on a lot of people but yeah, click on the little bell, comment, share. Please be polite to each other down in the comments below. Don't be mean. Don't be negative. I don't. I will not allow negativity into this channel. I just want to be a positive environment, a safe environment where you guys can express yourselves and just be yourself without being judged. So I hope you guys enjoy the video. If you did, go ahead and give it a thumbs up again. Thank you so much for your love and support. I love you all. Until next time. See ya.